Hello chat, what is up? What is up? Yes, I'm late. I'm usually a bit late. Stop the writing. God. How are you guys doing? Let's see. I guess it's all turned off. Of course not. Okay. That one. And that one. Switch things. What's up, what's up, what's up? Okay. Uh, hello. We'll just restart there. Save settings. Dashboard. Yeah, man. Show me. Fatters for 40 months saying hello, you little shit. Hi, hi back, Fatris. What's up? What's up, guys? Why would I call Ravs? You know, it was his birthday yesterday. But you see, he'll be here tomorrow. You know, he'll be here tomorrow. We'll figure out something special for that stream. Beard's getting more and more ginger every week. Yeah, of course. Of course. That's how it goes, you know? Sadly, that is just how it goes. Uh, what the f... Why... Is this here? Okay. Well, fuck it. <laughs> fuck it. Slowly form to summon. Am I there? I'm here. I'm here. What's up with the color? Mm -hmm. What is the stream for? This is just this is my stream slot. This is just my stream slot. <laughs> Core Ross is yeah, hungover. He, oh, he's very hungover. I don't even need to call him to know that. Okay. Uh, we're going to be playing uh, a new game today. Something I picked up yesterday. Because it looks quite interesting. It's called West of Loathing. Um, we'll see how it goes. We'll see how it is. If uh, in an hour and a half we notice eh, it's not that great. Uh, we'll do something else. But let's give it a go, you know. It's always nice to give something a go. Uh, a go. Please call Ravs. Please. No, I'm not calling Ravs. I'm not calling Ravs. Ravs typed, he typed 45 minutes ago, Ravs typed, help, I am die. Okay? He typed, help, I am die. I'm pretty sure you can, you can kind of get his reaction. You know, you know, in what kind of state he is. So. So, yeah. We'll do him tomorrow. You know, you know, we'll get him on tomorrow. As per usual, we'll do the, the, the funny stuff and then, then we'll celebrate his birthday. <laughs> when am I doing Stardew Valley again? Don't know. I look started on my books. Uh, no, not right now. I'm just very, very, very tired. International has been going on and in the, uh, for Dota 2 and the International for Dota 2 falls on time frames. I'm not particularly friendly to Europeans, but it's once a year, so I'm like, fuck it, you know? I watch uh, I watch it all, and yeah, it, it gets a little late. It gets a little, little late. Yeah, right, Kappa. No. I mean, I've admitted it before, I do smoke, but not before streams, so... Was my reaction to the new Valve revealed? Pretty much the same as the audience, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> There's enough card games out there. Uh, let's get some commercials going, and then we're gonna start the game. Feels bad, man. Yeah. Feels fucking bad, man. Feels pretty fucking bad, man. We had a grand finals tonight. 
Oh, my boys, my boys are out, but you know, one of my favorite players still in, Kuroki. So I'm gonna be cheering him on. Gonna make sure he wins. You know what I'm saying? I'm not calling Ralphs. I'm definitely, I'm genuinely, I'm not gonna call Ralphs. I'm not gonna call Ralphs. Fear you're playing every left to play left for the three because Ralphs are confident. Well. Yep. It's a bit of a shame, you know. Now he's on stream tonight, I could do an extra stream tonight to make up for it. Why do you think he's on streaming tonight? Because we're watching TI together. I'm not gonna take that slot. <laughs> so, yeah. It's grand final day. Like, it's 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 important. We're all watching, it's gonna be hype as shit. It's gonna be great. Let's send out a tweet. Let's send out a tweet. Uh Loathing. Come join. Yeah, man. There we go. Slash Yogscast. Okay. Bam, bam, okay, that's all, that's done, that's good, that's good, and we go over here, that's alright, yep, okay, this is all good, dashboard, Let Ravs die in peace, guys. It's fine. Will this game have lots of deaths? I don't know. We will uh, we will find out, I suppose. What are ads? He knows what ads are. It's just capping, you know, Lewis cap. But because he's a sub, he's not getting them. Mark Homer subscribed with Prime for nine months. Thank you so much. So fuck Mary Kill Ben Tom Lewis. Oh That's a difficult one man. That's a difficult one. I like all these guys a lot. I like them all a lot. Mm. Hmm. How about... Yeah. Fuck! This is tricky. I'd say... Marry Tom. Marry Tom, fuck Lewis, kill Ben. I'm not entirely sure about that one. But probably that one. Probably, probably like that. <laughs> Good choices. Thanks. Appreciate that. All right, we've got 13 seconds. Why hate for Ben? Uh, there's no hate for Ben. I really like Ben. Ben's a good guy. But, you know, so are the other two guys. You know? You know? It's difficult. That's why these questions are so difficult. Okay. Uh, let's, let's start the game. Hmm. 
Neon Prototype 1996. We stopped for three months saying, Marry Ben, fuck Tom, kill Lulu. It's fair. It's fair. You know. Oh. Is he going to capture the game? There it is, nice. Fuck Mary Kill Pun and Nazi Ravs. Oh god. Oh god. Fuck Mirko Pun and Ozzy Roth. Probably marry Panda. Fuck Rob's kill Nazi. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Okay. Okay. So. Oh, guys. There's a colorblind mode. There's a colorblind mode. There's a colorblind mode for a fucking black and white game. Okay. Great. You never know. You never know, right? You never know. Okay. Well, let's try it out. The music is still a little loud for my liking. I'll put it in colorblind mode. I, I can't. Best font mode. <laughs> Please don't do this. This play is a log to describe what happens in combat provides a few other pieces of metagame information in various places. Nice. Turns on ground level indicator of a combatant positioning. Allows the game to level up your skills for you attempts to create a well rounded character. Why can't I not click any of these though? Why can't I look click any of these? Why are they greyed out? Ah, fuck it. Alright, let's go. New game. Wanted for protagonizing. Shelly, Bl Shelly Barth. 622 meat. Change your character. How do I change my character? What? Guys have no audio? Why can you guys not hear? Let me restart it. Gonna check if I can hear it this time. No, the audio is pretty cool, so I would like that to be in there. Can you hear it now? Why can you not hear the game?
Wait, I think I know. I know, I know, I know. Well, good volume for you guys. Still very loud, 14. Okay, well, third to 10. How's it? This is very quiet for me. Microphone is a bit quiet. That's weird. One sec. Let's get this all out of the way now. I'll just quickly turn my mic up a little bit. Wait, wait, wait. How is this? How is this? That's good. Good, good. Okay. Perfect. Let's do this. I'm gonna change it back to full screen. Okay, new game. <laughs> Wanted for protagonizing. Ben Maverick. I like Leva. I like Ben Maverick. So what happens when I change the character? Good morning, Silas. Time for my obligatory merch question and also will you be going to the upcoming cons? I will be at Insomnia uh, 61 in just a little less than two weeks. I'm uh, a little bit, a little bit weird. Uh, I'm, hmm. So how does this work? I'm confused. Well, fuck it. You're Ben Maverick. Oh, a class. Okay, are we gonna be a cow puncher, a bean slinger, or a snake oiler? Cowboys assault their problems with their fists, whether it's shaking them a disagreeable feller in a, dis a disreputable saloon, or using them to punch a slightly more disagreeable feller in a slightly less reputable saloon. You've heard that cowboys are in demand out west since the cows came home, which stands to reason. The cows aren't going to punch themselves after all. Okay, the bean slinger. Magic and cooking are inextricably intertwined in loathing, and the bean slinger is the mystery, a mystical master of both. You've heard there's a shortage of cooks out west since the cows came home, due to the most, uh, due to most of the cooks having been brutally killed by the cows. Shit, son. These cows, they're, they're sounding great. Snake oilers rely on their moxie and chutzpah to tame snakes, their fearlessness to extract potent oils from those snakes, and their cleverness to manufacture and sell potions made from those oils. 
You've heard snake orders are doing very well. Out west since the cows came home. Everybody needs potions and hope in these dark days. And also out west is where all the best snakes live. What do you guys think? See you around, Trixer. Thanks for stopping by. Snake oiling? Ah, yeah, I'm seeing a lot of snake oilers. We're gonna have some moxie and chutzpah. Goodbye, bed. Time to head west to chase my real dreams. Goodbye, desk. Oh, let's comb our hair. But we don't have any hair. <laughs> hey, Rasta, how you doing? Somebody once told me the world is gonna roll me. I ain't the sharpest tool in the shed. She was looking kind of dumb with her finger and her thumb, in the shape of an L on her forehead. Well, the years start coming and they don't stop coming, Kappa. <laughs> Thanks, Mr. Hey, outside dude. Crawl! I'm gonna miss you, buddy. <laughs> go, go, go. Let's feed him a cricket. Ah. Uh, are we taking Russell with us, guys? I think maybe it's time for him to leave too, guys. Russell. You open your bedroom window, not pictured, and enlarge the door to Russell's cage. He winks at you, calls one last time, then flies away to the west. Russell's free. Goodbye, phonograph. Okay. You read the spine of one of your books. Earl Swift and the Mystery of Butcher's Lighthouse. Dad gave me this one when I was a kid. Clyde Swift in the incident at Vulture Cabin. You remember that one? Be a Smith and the Curse of Skeleton Cave. Claudio Bobsy in the Mystery of the Cursed Canyon. Mom gave me this one a few years ago. The Miracle at Rattlesnake Citadel. I love that one. Oh, hey. I go on uh, Walking Stupid. Hell yeah. Walking stupid. This book tells the tale of Renegade Sheriff who was really, really bad at walking. Unlock stupid walking as an option. Hell yeah. Stupid walking is bad as the option when you've got a perk stupid walking. Hell yeah. You accidentally drop the book and then ruin it by stepping on it 30 times while you're trying to pick it up. Oops. Okay, I li I'm liking this a lot so far. You, your gear, your stuff. Info. Okay. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. How oh, is this stupid walking? This is legit walking. This is the, this is the only way to walk. Oh. Oh, yes. This book is incredible. <laughs> oh Jesus! Don't oh, come back in. Nothing on the hat rack today. Damn it! What a mess! Oh yes, get some experience. Sweet. This hearth really pushed, it puts the hearth in hearth and home. Yeah, it does. You're gonna miss mom's cooking. I will. Is mom's pie safe? It keeps all her pies safe. I miss meals with the family. Yes, I will. My little brother's room. Oeuvre mathématiques de Varis de Galois. Yes, that is about math. Yeah. You pick up one of your brother's weird books and flip through it. Voorlesungen über Zalen Theorie. How many different languages do you need to know to learn about numbers? Yeah, that is again, that's again math. Oeuvre mathématiques de Varis de Galois. Just a tight pink issue, your headache. Yeah, it does. 
über die Darstellbarkeit einer Funktion durch eine Trigono trigonometrische Reihe. Something about math as well. What a nerd our brother is. What a nerd. It's covered with all of these weird diagrams and charts. Jesus. Ooh, toy box. It's going to be math later, isn't it? Cool. A puzzle cube. Can we solve it? It's so tidy. Okay. Okay. Fiddle bit. I figured out last couple. I'm fucking. I'm so smart. So smart. I'm missing the music though. Hell yeah, we work so well. Turn the music back on. This is the best way to walk. I'm leaving now, Mom. You're gonna miss you, kiddo. Oh, before you leave, I got you a present. Oh. A present. Yep, it's that book you wanted for Crimble. I know it's early, but... Oh. They want about picking locks. They want about desert survival. They want about bartering. I think we want to be able to pick some locks, right? Bar you guys are saying barter? So we're saying survival. I think lock picking though, guys. I think we're gonna do some lock picking. Please be careful out there. Write us a letter when you can. I will, mom. Goodbye. Oh, this is the way to walk. Just want one more hug. <laughs> this fucking game already, man. Okay, we're gonna learn how to leak, uh, re, le, 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 pick locks. Hold chapter. Yes. After you're done reading it, you donate to a local orphanage. Soon, those orphans will be able to make their escape. Go orphans, go! Hell yeah. Oh, oh yeah. Okay. Options. Oh, right. Oh, we have stupid walking here now. Okay. Let's do colorblind on. Best for... Oh, God. No. No, 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 no. Let's get... I want nerd mode on, of course. Okay. Stupid... We're walking... Is that our little brother? Your father morosely jabs at the haystack. That hat doesn't fit you, Dad. I'll grow into it. Damn it. It's time for me to leave. Listen. I want you to have this. It's it's your grandmother's briefcase full of snakes. Thanks, Dad. Good good luck out there. Be sure to say goodbye to your mother. I did. Goodbye, Dad. We got a briefcase full of snakes! Do we look inside? We look inside. There are a lot of snakes in this briefcase. Let's extract some medicine. And some venom. Let's just have some of both. Your brother Rufus is standing here looking nervous. He's pretty good at looking nervous. Give him his puzzle back. Bye. Hey Rufus. Time for me to head west. Uh, I still don't understand why you're leaving. It's got a point, you know. Why are you going west anyway? Oh, where are we going west? Are we seeking for fortune? Are we helping people? Are we getting off the stupid farm? Stupid farm. I'm seeing a lot of twos. 
Who's to seek my fortune? Fight. To seek my fortune. There's just no opportunity here, kid. If I'm gonna make something myself, I gotta go where I can make some meat. Uh, well, it's so dangerous. 60% of the people who go west get killed within a year. And that statistic is from before the cows came home. I'll be okay. You worry about taking care of mum and dad. I'll worry about me. Okay, if you say so. I still think you'll be dead by Creambo. I'll miss you, Rufus. Okay. It's a haystack. We got a needle. Why are they all barely holding it together? Okay, great stuff. Are we going west? Yes, we are. Now we're not skipping opening credits. This is going to be great. Look at that horse. Looks a bit like you, Vatris. What's up, Neverstyle? How are you doing? Two hundred miles later. Okay. Well, the bad news is that you fell off the cart and got knocked out for a couple of hours. And now you've got no ride, no meat, and no prospects. The good news is that you're in a town, rather than in a gulch somewhere. Not much of a town, though. Alright, let's get up and dust ourselves off. The town of Boring Springs. Let's get the turnip. Hey, dude. Hey, buddy. Hey, buddy. Can I... So I can... I'll tell you what I'm doing. Hey, buddy. Some horse. Hey, I'm... Mostly in here. Yup. As you walk into the saloon, the crazy-eyed guy sitting to the left of the door shrieks and waves at you to get your attention. Hey! Where's your hat, Dagnabbit? Well, I... You can't drink it here without a hat. It ain't proper. He points to the take-a-hat-leave-a-hat box next to the door. Alright. I find a battered derby. Alright, grab it. Hell yeah! Thanks, uh... Pete! Thanks, Pete. He gives you a friendly or somewhat twitchy look. Say, fella. Yeah? You, you're heading west. If you want some company, I'd be more than happy to come along. Just let me know. Well, er, uh, no pressure. All right, I'll keep it in mind. Okay, we'll keep it in mind. Oh. Let's look at it. Yeah, it's a little spit, regular spit, gross tobacco spit, chewing gum, and it looks like a few teeth as well. It's disgusting, and the smell even from a distance smells horrible. Look closer! Ugh. You know, you had to do spear into this filthy, crusted spittoon. I don't, I don't understand what is wrong with you. Wait, is there something shining at the bottom? <laughs> Get it. Ugh. You can feel the gross in the air like a greasy fog enveloping the stinking brass, or it smells like the vomit through... At before the trough, trough at the mesquite barbecue eating contest, you hesitate. Never surrender! Search! Your fingers make contact with something. You pull your hand out of the devil's tree slowly, not daring to risk smashing the contest all over yourself. You appear to have got some kind of ring, probably some kind of disease as well. Congratulations! Hooray! We got a nasty ring! <laughs> this way we'll get all the spit off us. By walking the coolest way possible. Oh.
Can I equip that ring? We got it. Fuck yeah. Okay. Ah, oh, we don't have meat! Damn it. This guy is asleep. You walk into the barn, wait patiently for the butler to notice you. While you're waiting, you see a sign taped to the back wall reading. We roared for lost mugs, 25 meat each! Howdy, cowboy! No, no, that's a wrong, that's a wrong. Howdy, cowboy! Howdy, barkeep, name's Ben. What brings you to our little back boy? Oh, the usual. I came out west to make my fortune. Not having much luck, uh, much luck so far, though. Any work around these parts? Unfortunately, Bone Springs already has more people in it than jobs. It's more of a, an errant town, if you catch my meaning. If you're looking for a real job, I'd recommend talking to the railroad people up by Dirtmore. Alright. The railroad? The Manifest Destiny Railroad Company. From back east. They're trying to run a line to Frisco and having a heck of a time doing so. And they're hiring? Oh, I reckon they're always hiring for one thing or another. Big company, that. Alright. Dirt War. Dirt War is, uh... It's interesting. It's far enough west that it's still more or less exempt from the rule of law. But not so far west that it's been burned down to the ground by those damn cows. Lots of opportunity there. Pause for a few seconds, listen to Yep. If I were a younger man, I'd probably head that way myself. You mentioned some errands. Yeah, this uh, this forsaken burg has always fallen apart in one way or another. The hostler's always needing help since he hurt his leg, and that no account sheriff could certainly stand to have somebody doing his job for him. Anything else? Well, I've got a goblin loose in the basement, some cow poking from the gulch, steam wipe his boots off, and got spores everywhere. We can fucking handle a goblin. Much obliged. I'll unlock the basement door for you. Oh, well, you'll need this. A weak fungicide. <coughs> this is how you walk, guys. This is how you walk. Okay. We're gonna get the, go the goblin. We have no weapons, I just noticed. Um... Hmm. Hmm. I can't use the needle. We need, we need a weapon. All right. Howdy, I'm Ben. Howdy, Ben. I'm Horace. <laughs> Nice to meet you. What do you do? I'm the town hostler. I don't know what that is. Or how's that work? How's that working out for you? Oh, those horses are just flying out the door. So business is booming. Nice. No, I mean the horses keep running away. I haven't sought one in ages. Oh. Is that, is that why you're here drinking instead? Oh, yep. I mean, being in here drinking instead of watching the horses is probably how they keep escaping. It's one of those vicious circle things. Well, I'm in need of a horse. Do you have any left? One. Kind of a boring one, but it's got four legs in the back to sit on. Come see me at the stable. I'm happy to show it to you. Okay. Okay. Of course, it starts uh, starting to sound strange, uh, strangely similar. I'm not. I'm not a voice actor. I'm, I'm trying my best. Let's take a newspaper. Boring Springs Gazette, April twentieth, eighteen ninety-five. What's what does it say? Oh, it's from about six weeks ago. This goblin looks dangerous, guys. Whiskey! Briark. Okay. Let's fight! Oh! I will do four damage to the target. I have one action point. Well, this current target is a goblin. 
Yes. Hell yeah. Are Moxie increased by one? Gemma to Kevin Bruce for six months. Like, hey, might not be here as much just beca uh, because I just moved uh, into uni, but got a lot of streams also since Vatris isn't here. W spam doesn't work for subs, but I appreciate it anyway. Thank you, Jay Uh Good luck, callers, man. And uh, yeah, stop by whenever you have time. But of course, callers is far more important. Howdy. Get to see you again, Ben. To get a goblin. Thank you kindly, Ben. I knew you was a stand-up fella the moment you walked in here. He grabs a bag of meat. Here you go. It's the least I can do by way of thanks. 200 meat. Oh, yes. Who's the lady? That's Susie. She's a rancher from nearby. A real tough broad. I didn't recommend you pest her. What's that? Lost her whole family to a cow attack recently. Got some pent up frustrations about it. Okay. No. Oh, see you around, Fabulous. Howdy, Susie. <coughs> Howdy, cowboy. Howdy, cowboy who's gonna be searching the spittoon for his teeth if he doesn't leave me in peace. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Okay. That's what he's saying, something yeah. Yeah. Oh, oh my. This is how we walk. This is how we walk now. Let's try. Let's play. I get a pair of tens, plus a two, a three, and a king. Okay, so we, uh, we have a pretty, we have a pretty strong hand. We have a pretty strong hand. But if one of them has a king, or like a bear pair. <laughs> Definitely didn't almost miss the stream because T ruined my sleep schedule. Go Team Liquid. Have you been watching the whole thing too, Xylus? Hell yeah, I have, Slay. Go Team Liquid. Go team liquid for sure. It's gonna be exciting tonight. Okay, are we gonna bet aggressively? I think we're gonna bet aggressively. We have a pretty decent hand. You sure your pair of tens plus two uh, plus two three king. The guy on the guy the left has a full house. How did they both have a better hand than me? We didn't win, we're gonna horn swallow them. You explain the checks are worth 9 points each. Give it a guy on the left a total of 21 points, and the guy on the right 20, and you're 25 plus a king. And the king represents, oh hey, look over there. They look, and when they look back, they don't notice a 10 meter missing from each of their pals. You collect your winnings and stand up. The guys, thank you for helping them learn the game. You're welcome, guys. Oh yes, oh yes, we rich now, we rich now, we horn swoggled them, sweet, alright, let's explain this, let's, oh, ugh, the student, the sheriff, God, what voice is this guy gonna have, fuck, howdy stranger, welcome to Boris Springs, I'm the sheriff in this part. 
Okay. Thanks. Thanks, mistake. Welcome to Borg Spriggs. I'm the sheriff in these parts. The, the what? The sheriff, okay? Lots of sign payers. Say, you wouldn't happen to be looking for work, would you? Depends on the word, buddy. But how does this grab you? There's a gang of hoodlums around here that call themselves the Fricker Gang. Last time I arrested one of them, they busted him out and took my cell door whim. It ain't, uh, well, it ain't much good without the door. Yes. And? And I need somebody tough, smart, and, and or slick to go fetch it back for me. So, so, why don't you go do it? You're the sheriff after all, right? I gotta stay here and protect my chair tipping. And practice my chair tipping. Funny you should say that, because I'm sending the deputy along with you to keep you out of trouble. Deputy business? You deputized a gun? You're new in town. Maybe you ain't noticed, but there ain't much to do here except drink. Here, let me write down where the Freaky Gang's hideouts for you. It makes a little money that. The Freaky Gang's hideout. Got it! We'll be back in. Yeah, that's, that's correct. That's right. That, that sounds not going to do much, is it? Naked Mike Bernstein, 200 meters for Burt theft. Shit. Beat me freaker for face thieving. 420 me. Okay. Good stuff. Oh. Step right up, step right up. Prates the name and trades the game. Seriously, doubt his name is Prate. Howdy, Prate. What are you trading? Well, sir, today I'm trading locks for soap and a stick of dynamite for a needle. And to the cunning skinner who brings me three raw snake hides, well, to that adventurous soul, I will trade a fine silver pocket watch. Did we trade the dynamite for my needle? The needle is used for pickpocketing, though. So let's, let's not trade just yet. Just yet. See you in a bit, guys. Yeah, I, I'm not going to try the needle. Howdy, Cactus Man. Howdy yourself. And the name's Bill. Cactus Bill. Well, to be honest, partner, I drank too much Cactus Beer. And it turned me into a cactus. Though Kyle's warned me this what happened, but I didn't listen. That's why they call you cactus, but no, that's just a coincidence. Does it hurt? It's what hurt. You know, being a cactus. Oh, <laughs> no, it's actually kind of nice. Natural fermentation process inside the cactus part of me keep me pretty drunk most of the time. I guess it is a mite boring. I wouldn't be so bad if I had something to read. You don't happen to have a newspaper or anything, do you? We do. Much obliged, partner. Now let's see here what can I do to return a favor. Oh, I know. My shovel. I live it behind the, or the outhouse at Orhol Mine. It's yours if you go and get it. I'm sure you'll find a use for it. Thanks, guys. Behind the outhouse at Orhol Mine. Got it. Thanks, Bill. Don't mention it. Now, if you could just uh, kind of stick that newspaper to my face before you leave. Sweet. Look at that. Beautiful. What's this? So we've been to the sheriff. Sorry, the sheriff. Oh, hey! I'm 
most of Hey, watch it. Buddy. Oh, I come from... You don't get enough time to read it out. But flow, girl. Scott. Excuse me, mister. Excuse me. Oh, we just... Be bullshit horsey, eh? A thousand meat for a horse. How's business? Oh, you know. Every day I'm hustling. To say the truth is pretty terrible. Allow my horse to keep running away. Well, except for this completely ordinary one. Oh, three which phrase for you. How many are there? Or whole mine. Borg Springs Boneyard and a thousand snakes gulch. I think they like environments that are thematically appropriate. Here, when you find one, feed it one of these oats. That should send it back here. So, your special pigeon infused oats. Man, this horse is looking cool. Okay. Yuck. Where's this guy keep coming from? Okay. Let's go. Oh, I need a horse. Okay. So where's... Oh. Oh! Oh! Oh, we got a shiny rock. Ow! Ow! Attack it. Whip it! Hell yeah! Hell yeah! They call me Snake Murder in Ben. Yeehaw! Let's kill a level two. You click one venom with one medicine. But hey! Okay. Another snake! Whoa! <gasps> Back at full HP now. Oh. Every trick in the book to beat this one. <laughs> Let's deploy a snake. Risky. Yeah. Okay. You can also become a snake and search to terminate it. Yeah, I could be. Completely. Sweet. Sweet, sweet, sweet. Oh. Oh! Hey there, boy. Hey, I fell out for it. It's good, right? It's good. Let's look him in the eyes. Kind of the gorgeous eyes, one of them is fixed in a glassy thousand yard stare, and the others are falling madly in the socket. Like he's thinking of trying to escape in every direction simultaneously. He looks to be calming down a little now that it's clear you aren't actually made of spiders. You 
carefully and gently pat the horse's nose. He twitches a bit, okay, a lot, but seems to recognize that you aren't going to eat his eyes or suck out his sore, wherever it matters. This is bouncing around, that's called a hiss. Yeah. Alright, let's feed the oats. You feed the crazy oats with the homing oats and it gallops away with a witty, or rather a. <laughs> Hopefully, he's headed home and not into the 12th dimension. Cool. Sweet. We made it. We done did it. We done did it. Ow! Oh. Okay, let's go to the Boring Springs Boneyard. Rip. Oh. Our founder, Zephaniah Boring. 1806 to 1885, he was actually a really interesting guy. I don't doubt it. Ooh, let's grab the mug. We've got a mug. Benjamin Crockett. He showed up way too early. Bur Beauregard Skelton. Captain 3rd Cavalry, 1820-1866. This grave is really noisy. Why is it noisy? It's a skeleton! A scuffle it is. Shoot. Bam! Ow! Punch him. Hell yeah. Cool. Cool, cool. That guy just wouldn't stay put. Oh my god, that's a ghost horse! Again, pat on the nose again. Sorry, the oats. Are they not spooky enough? I'm not sure how to make that spooky. In case you can put some bones on them, I don't think I need to grind up bones with grave dirt. All right, I found some grave dirt. A little bit grave dirt and hold them out again. The horse gazes expressionlessly at them and then eats them. And with that, he slides away in the direction of the town. That's a bit weird. Timothy Cochran. Devoted husband. Elizabeth Cochran, beloved door. Silas Cochran, a baby. Oh my. What happened here? Okay, let's 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 just let's just tumble with Okay. Sweet. Okay, where are we going? We're going to uh, the Orhole Mine. Oh, no, 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 no. We got the shovel. Meat! Poster on the wall behind reads level one blasting cap storage, level two plungers, level three tools. Let's go to get some tools. Let's pick the lock. Go crowbar. Sweet. Nuggets. Wait, they're mining meat in this place? There's another plunger hooked up to it. Hmm. Hmm. Okay, level two. Oh!
Hop. Boom. Oh. How did he get in here? So much. Hey there, girls. Okay, I'm Fred. The horse shies away from you, though. In this case, it's more like a crippling introvert. It's away from you. Okay. Don't be like that. Look, I brought the oats for you, dude. Of course, or anything. In your respect, I guess that wasn't a very cool thing to say. Power on the notes. Here are the oats. Take out of the bag and toss them in your mouth. Ugh! It's like the roughest, blandest breakfast cereal you've ever eaten. Still, it's better than dry cat food. Don't ask. I will. You smile to show the horse that you're fine and realize that you've unconsciously turned around and walked out the door. Jeez, these are powerful. The horse looks at you warily as you re-enter with a cheerful wave. See? Let's feed her. Come on! There's a good girl. Come on, eat the sack. So, go to the gang side. Oh, awake him. Hey, you're not supposed to be here. Let's say he's no road scholar. If we assume that even seven, that in seven years from now, that idiom makes sense. I kind of feel bad about the idea of killing him. Let's fight. He's got 15 health. From Moxie. Oh! Mystic Hat level 2. Alright, gold to victory. Ooh! I don't have forging. Recovered mug. Silver cufflinks. Oh. Damn it, how about can we not forge yet? Okay, let's go to the cave. Bar soap. Let's stick. Of course, we approach the freak again. They're pretty gross in their poker game, so it doesn't actually require that much caution. You hide behind a barrel and you eavesdrop on their conversation for a while. The one with the ice patch, eye patch is quiet. But you gather that his name is Snipe. And that the squirrely one is his brother, Wimpy. Which my player. Okay, let's approach them and talk. Howdy, boys. Still me in? Who are you? How'd you get past Thunder Soapy? What do you want? Come on, it's Bimmy. I'm your brother. Bimmy? You ain't Bimmy. I'm so Bimmy. I stole some room's face. We've got to get out of here, fast. The Pinkertons are on to us. They'll be here any minute. Dag nabbit. Come on, Snipe. Let's hightail it. I'll catch up. Let's grab the door and skedaddle. Man, this game is fantastic. Oh, we've got some meat. Whoa, ho. Grab the door. Grab the mug. Just tie him up. Let's 
sweet. We done did it. Okay. Can we force this yet? No. Let's go back to the town. We had a shovel. Can we start digging yet? So that's shit. That's also shit. That's still shit. This guy, I could trade a bar of soap for something, right? For a look. Yeah. I'll take the soap. I'll take the look, I mean. I really don't think his name is actually Braid. No. Oh, I can dig that. Another recovered mug. Okay. Dig at the grave. Oh, what's the graveyard? Oh, here, yeah. Oh! Bad idea. Captain Skeleton. Oh, Jesus. He hits hard. Shoot! I should be able to take him. Shoot! Yes! We killed, we killed Captain Skeleton. Oh, shit! Glamour level 3, an old cavalry saber, and a gold tooth. Shit, son. We rich now. Talk about giving faster. Okay. Have we let's just let's just check everywhere to see if we've we've I wanna find out as much as possible in this game, honestly. Okay, we don't need to dig anything here. Uh we already dig it. yeah. We got them all! I want this horse, though. Sure thing, pal. Thanks. You're welcome. Yeah, he was. Oh. Thanks. He gave us exactly enough for a horse. What a, what, what a, what a, what a convenience, isn't it? He said something really about an injury. Yeah, busted my knee while mucking out the showroom. Don't ask how, it's embarrassing. She's gonna get Doc Alice to have a look at it, but she gave up doctoring. What you do that? Nobody knows. She just shut herself up in her office. Said she wouldn't talk to anyone except Nurse Whiskey. <coughs> Is that an actual nurse, or, uh... Pretty sure she must be sarcastic. <laughs> okay, well, we'll buy a horse later. Sheriff, I got your door. Nice work, stranger. This is prison cell just go about four times more secure. Are there any freaking boys left for me to run up? Yeah, one or two that are asleep. What a job. Go around them short. Looks like I owe you a reward. 400 meats. Got a little task for you if you've got the time. Should be a lot simpler than the last one. What the is busted the lock when they took the door. Gonna need a new lock. Sapper to have one. That'll do nicely. The sheriff puts the lock on the cell door and accidentally hot off the key and it claps into the cell. Hellfire! I'm supposed you know how to pick a lock, stranger. You got a needle handy? I don't have a needle! <laughs> Fuck! Oh, whisker delivery free dog. There's whiskey a favor, I'm led to believe. Didn't know she makes house call. Alright, hold on. Have a needle. A pair of tweezers and plug some fume on sight of the eyebrows. A pair of tweezers. Oh. Look, Alice looks to be about in her 50s. Her hair is graying and her face is lined. Her eyes still clear and sharp. If blood short, she also her whiskey stat. Don't give it to her. Well, what the hell did I do for her? You shrugged. Alright, fine. You can have the whiskey. 
She cracks open the whiskey, fills a small flask, she takes it with a cork, and then she puts the flask back in the cork and starts struggling out the bowl. Please, doctor, doesn't seem healthy. Where's the doctor here? Mirror you. Okay, point taken. Fine. This doesn't seem safe. Yeah, that should be further from the fireplace. Yeah, be a little bit, a bit cheerful, Doc. The legend of Curly's meat. Legendary treasure, a massive chest full of premium meat. She created in the western desert by an old cowhand named Curly Barfield. Shit. Life and works of Fred Ferguson. You find this a re reason that drunken alcohol is bad, so it's actually a work of ludicrous speculative fiction. Haha. <laughs> At least there are some useful appendices in the back and some diagrams of appendices. Sweet. The goblinoid tongue is a primer. Goblin life it's confusing and perfect when you got so gross by the time that you take a break from reading really several blurfs have passed, and you also now know that blurf is the goblin word for hour. I've learned to speak goblin sort of sweet. The chef the chef and needle. You're skating now. You're skating now. This should really be further from the fireplace. This is this is I don't feel that fast I can get this whiskey into my bloodstream compared to how fast my liver filters it out and I can't talk and drink at the same time, so this is a little What's the matter, Doc? Bad it's cow demons, dead men walking. Why don't you go ahead and pick one and I'll drink to that? Dead men walking? Corpus of skeletons staggering around like puppets with half the strings cut, looking to take a bow and Oh yeah, there's a skeleton in the cemetery. It's nice to get some outside confirmation I'm not losing my damn mind. But how's it? It is impossible. It goes everything against I uh, it goes against everything I know about medicine. Dead patients don't get back up. Patients? Oh gosh. Every doctor loses one now and again. You never get used to it, but well, it happens. But what doesn't happen is them coming back afterwards and looking for revenge. That must be rough. Rough? Buddy, I don't think you comprehend the situation. It's not just patients, it's neighbors, friends, husbands. Um, indeed. Shins Raphian focuses attention back on the ball. Okay. Any, any idea what's causing resurrections? Rumor. <laughs> It's where you get incomplete information from an unverf. <laughs> oh. Anyway, <laughs> what I heard is that there's a fella out west that's causing it. A necromancer, they call him. Supposedly, he's sending magic out into the world somehow. Magic like the beanslingers use? <clears throat> Never heard of any beanslingers raising the dead, have you? That'd be one hell of a can of beans. Well, it would be. Oh, fuck no. I need a drink. Talking too much. Okay. Oh, okay. What's anyone on the TNT? It's so when I feel like I'm about to go, I can blow myself into bits so small there won't be nothing left to come back. Seems drastic. Drastic hell. No way I'm think I'm taking the risk to become one of those things. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh god. How about that necromancer? Someone else to try to stop him. I know you ain't talking about me. Why not? A grey haired old woman that knows as much about fighting as a squirrel. No surgery. Did you hit your head on a barstool, kid? You aren't that old. You aren't that old, and if I were going to pick someone to go up against a necromancer, it'd be someone who also knows about death, but in a scientific way. A doctor, right? And it sounds to me like you've got plenty of motivation to get a job done for your friends and, and everyone. It beats doing nothing anyway. Beats looking yourself in a house full of TNT and drinking yourself to death. You aren't even doing any doctoring anymore. You seriously expect me to ride out west by myself chasing a rumor? Doesn't have to be by yourself. I'm heading west too. Tag along with me and maybe we can find a guy and put a stop to him. It's crazy. 
Impossible. Impossible, like raising the dead is impossible? Alright, kid. What the hell? Let's give it a shot. Cool. You're going on an adventure with a drunk nurse. What could possibly go wrong? Hey? What could possibly go wrong? What's up, Kayo? Alright. Can we go there already? Or do we need to get the, the horse? To do that. Okay, we need to get a needle. Where are we gonna get a needle in this place? Wait. Yes! Another needle! People keep stacking needles in these haystacks. I definitely picked a lock. I like the selfie. The sheriff walks into the cell, picks up the key, he looks around for a place to hide it, and the venture sticks it under his hat. Thank you kindly, stranger. If Borg Strings ever gets any more criminals, they better watch out. That's a good job you've done. Don't mention it. Oh! We're sheriff now. We're sheriff now, boys. Hell yeah. We got no offhand. I'm sure that's better than the crowbar. Right? Oh no. What's the point of these silver cufflinks? Oh, right. Okay. I found these mugs. Sweet. We already got 150 mug gold for all those mugs. Okay. Fine. Are you Susie Cochran? I, I, I saw the grace of the cemetery. I saw it happen. So the whole damn thing, I couldn't do nothing about it. The bartender said it was cows. It was a raid. See, Ma and Pa used to ranch cattle back before. Well, before they came home. Pa didn't make it, but Ma and I managed to rebuild. We ranched pigs instead, and she left me the place when she passed. Well, I guess a parson heard stuff out that, I, uh, that it used to be a cow ranch and they attacked a couple of days ago. It happened so fast. I didn't even have the time to get my rifle out, the gun safe. A cow smashed in the front door and this fire started out back by the, uh, by the root cellar. House went up in blazes, just like that. What did you, what'd you do? I, there wasn't anything I could do. I couldn't get upstairs to the kids because of the fire. And I saw Tim <coughs> trampled right in front of me. I just... I didn't want to talk about it anymore. I'm sorry. What will you do now? Head west, I suppose. Nothing keeping me here and no desire to stay. I can't leave it without my rifle, though. It was Ma's rifle. It's all I got left of... of anybody. I left it at the ranch like some damn fool. Listen, can I ask you a favor? I need someone to go get it for me. I'll go get it. The Cochrane Ranch. Sweet. Okay. Okay. Let's go. Oh. Oh. No. Poor Susie. Is there gonna be a cow here? Oh yeah, we got a skinning knife. Shit! A pyro bow. I like that. Wya! Oh Jesus!
Got it. Hooray! I got Susie's rifle. Sweet. Why is it burning though? I don't know. Is there anything to stand it? Ow! Okay, looks like we're about done with this level, I think. Oh, wait. Done with all the shit shoveling. Yeah. Okay. Nope, that's a sheriff. Did you get your forging up? How do you do that? Here she is. I'm Ben. Thanks, man. I can't, can't really say what this means to me. She looks at the rifle for a long moment and looks back up at you. She sighs. Well, that's enough wallowing in misery. Time for me to hit the road. If you want me to tag along when you head west, just say the word. Sounds good. Yeah, how do we get my forging up? <coughs> what did you say, Pete? Who, me? Well, heck, I see all kinds of things. For instance, Tarnation. Some darn snake sank my battleship. Uh -huh. Pete knows his shiny rock you're carrying as well. Like, that there is a right shiny rock you got, stranger. I'll give you seven meat for that rock. Seven meat? Dope. Suit yourself. I'll take that silver nugget off your hands if you like. Give you 81 meat for it. <laughs> is, is it bad that I'm not selling? Should I sell this? Oh, it just says just sell it. Just to dig the currency in this game, yeah. Alright, fine, let's just send that to him. Fuck it. Okay. Listen, kid. All this stuff why I've been buying from you. You be spending time on the ground, ain't ya? Well, yeah, listen to old Pete's advice. You'll stay out of Orhole if you know what's good for you. There's stuff on the 14th level that ain't worth messing with for a fella who wants to keep his eyes. If you catch my meaning. Pretty sure I do. Oh, thanks. Okay. Just probably only sell the stuff that sell that just says just sell probably. It's probably a good idea. It's probably a good idea, but it's too late now. Trade. Do we have anything to trade? No, we're not. Actually, do we take some dynamite for an eel? How many eels do we have left? Just the one. Now nah, we might need that for pick locking. Off with me. So, how do we get our foraging up? Well, it's by a horse to begin with.
Oh. I was thinking crazy eyes myself. A little game plan for tomorrow? Uh, sort of. I'll get crazy eyes. Is uh, something wrong with him? But I'll take him. Okay, give him a name. There we go. There we go. Complimentary map. Thank you. Hello, crazy eyes. <laughs> that nay was uh, interesting. So, to the uh, Orhol mine. We're gonna finish this little level and then we're gonna take a little five minute ad break. The 40th level. A wave of nausea here just like the heavy lid of the chest. Inside there's a hat. It looks evil. I love it in an abstract way. It has eyes and they look like the eyes of a murderer. And it has teeth. Which look like the teeth of an animal who would be a murderer if animals understood the concept of murder. Put it on! <laughs> Something tells you this is better. It's me. I'm telling you this is a bad idea. If you put this hat on, you won't ever be able to take it off and things will be much harder for you. It will be as though your life is a game and that game's difficulty level is greatly increased if you catch my meaning. Guys, this is gonna be difficult. I want to have fun while streaming this. You know, I don't want to. I do not want this, guys. Damn it. What do I? No, uh. no, 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 no. I, I'm not going to do it. I'm not going to do it. It's too risky. I'm, I'm sorry. I'm pussying out. I'm pussying out. It's not happening. Pushing out. I'm oh, sorry. Wait, you can save? Oh, it automatically saves, it looks like. No trace right now, thanks. So have we done everything? No, the forging. How do we forge? Because there was that... Where was that? Was it here? It was like... A, this cactus. How do we get forging? 
This is basically the kingdom of loading, apparently, yeah. Hopefully we can get back there at some point. Just a different book of stars, probably. Yeah, probably. Alright. Let's go, Ravs. Oh. Okay. How do we decide who we take with us? and ready to start your new life in the West. All you need now is a partner. A partner. Somebody to share the trail with. Somebody you can rely on for emotional and combat support. Who will we take with us now? It's going to be easy. Uh, we're going to take our five minute break now. In the meantime, in that five minute break, I'm going to have a straw pull up. And you guys decide the follower. So after the five minute ad break, you guys... Uh, get to the side. Question. Uh, which follower? Crazy Pete. Doc Alice. Susie Cochran. Uh, we're not going to go there alone. We're going to take one of these followers just for fun. Great pull. Here we go. And five minutes of ads. Okay. Mm -mm -mm. This is a little fun so far, though. I was picking me up last night, just give it a go. I'm pleasantly, pleasantly surprised. I'm genuinely pleasantly surprised. So we're going to see in a, in a few minutes this, uh, who we're going to take with us. It's going to be exciting. It's going to be fun. Yeah, this game is apparently about nine hours long or something. So uh, we can get a few streams out of this. Oh, this, is, this is great so far. The humor is right up my alley. It's fantastic. I won't take a look at the results at all until the ad break is over. Okay. stuff okay check the reddit nursing whiskey's drinking it slowly yeah I know Okay. 
the loving is guaranteed. This was one I'm gonna have to It's more like it's 10% uh, off right now on Steam. Uh, it's really quite cheap for uh, like the standard of games these days. West of Loading right now is West of. It's about 10 euros. So I'd say about the same in dollars. <laughs> we'll get the we'll post a link a few like twice more. Yes, yeah, 989 euros as well. It's both 989 euros and 989 dollars, apparently. So, interestingly enough. We've got about a minute of ads left, and when the ads are done, we're going to see who we take. I don't know yet. I've not checked the results yet. We'll have to find out. Hello. Engine break is done. 60 seconds. Shades TV just uh, subbed. For 33 months. Oh my god, thank you so much. Really appreciate that. Welcome back. And thank you for your continued support. Okay. 30 seconds remaining. And then we go in. Then we shall be going. I, I'm, I'm fine with not knowing how many people wanted to throw me. Honestly. Okay. Here we go, ads are done. Poll is now closed. Let's look at the results. Doc Alice. All right. We've got Doc Alice with us. And close this down. Hit the trail. I will see if we go. Up to this point, I've been automatically spending your experience points for you. I to keep doing it, I promise to give you a nice, well-rounded experience. Shall I keep it up, or would you prefer to decide for yourself where your XP gets spent? You can always change this later on in the options menu. Let's just go for a well-rounded story. Let's just, let's just spend XP automatically. Let's go. If you guys want manual, I can change that. <laughs> so sure, we'll manually spin it. <laughs> this horse sounds great. This comb is main. It's sort of a glurk noise. Look at those eyes! <laughs> Where are the stats in this game? Well... Muscle, mysticality, moxie, grit, gumption, glamour, deadeye, horn swoggling, and lockpicking. Okay. 
No, I take it. Yeah. Well, we'll, we'll keep it on that for now, actually. I don't know how how, we, how much I'm going to be able to to. Really. It's my partner. If we're going to look into this necromancer business, I figure we ought to start with the local cemeteries. Make sense, you know where they are? Yeah, I did some research into the territory cemeteries a while back. See if there was a friend, you okay? Haha, ha, sorry. Anyway, there's, not too far, there's one not too far from here. The Dave Yard. I said that she's, uh, so she's been to see the bartender about running that room in dirt war. It'd be nice to have a base for operations. Okay. Saloon. Dirt war the mercantile. Dirt war the postal. F post office, I suppose. And the jail. Lots available. Another lot available, another lot available, another lot available. Not a lot available past this point, okay. Oh. We don't currently have a sheriff. If you're any good with a gun, there's always somebody in need of just some justice. One of the posts are back there, cells are over yonder. She points behind her head off to the right, respectively. It's a wasted poster. The stripy hat gang. For grand theft paint and tasteless hat vandalism. I've seen the vicinity of the Cavern Canyon. Dirty rotten paint thieves and low down, no fashion sense hat vandals. Despicable. Yeah, we're gonna go after them. There's a wonder post. The house in the desert gang. For mortgage non payment, squatting, and general public nuisance. Also for murdering two collection agents. Wow. Yeah. Them. Anyway, let's just go around the room. Salute. Oh god. Good, right? No, it's bad because it's only the war part spit that evaporates. This brass bucket is half full of the rest of the spit. The toxins and filth that don't evaporate. Several years of work is still the only concern until it's the consistency of molasses. People aren't allowed to flick cigarette butts into the spittoon anymore because they bounce out. You put your hat to the bucket something the color and viscosity of a maple syrup, except instead of maple, it's flavored with the inside of the mouth of people who chew cigars. Instead of smoking them and have never brush their teeth. Oh god. It feels like putting your hat into a bucket of lukewarm tapioca pudding. Except instead of tapioca, it's basically poison. It smells like someone ran over a skunk, waited a week, and set it on fire. It feels like your hand is dissolving. <laughs> you found something. You found a tacky filk covered porcelain cow figurine. A useless, disgusting thing that will make a great heirloom for your children, assuming you're still able to have any. You hate them. Hooray. <laughs> oh, God. She doesn't want to talk. Well, howdy, dear. It's always nice to see a new face in town. Welcome to the Jewel Saloon. Hi. Oh, thanks, I'm Ben. Glad to know you, Ben. <coughs> Folks already just call me Lloyd. What can I do for you? Nice to meet you, Lloyd. Okay, I can't really do these voices anymore. It's, it's, it's starting to fuck my throat up. 
Um, I saw the sign up front of dozen room. Finds room in the house and plenty of room for your partner to be interested. Well, that's where you're in luck. The previous tenant was a banker fella and he paid a month in advance right before getting himself killed by bandits. You see like a decent uh, sort, so the room's yours if you want it. Gratis. Great. Sweet. Got a free room. Are these guys sleep fighting? As you do. Sleep in deep. It's my partner. <laughs> Let me know if I find a whiskeying hole though. Heh! <laughs> Where's my partner again? I'm forgetting about anything. Alright, yeah, let's take care of those bandits. Alice's bet. You call yourself a good for nothing green booted jerk. <laughs> Angry. Insult myself again. Oh. You're liable to pass out. Oh shit. A blank postcard. I'm not going to sleep yet. I'm not going to sleep just yet. Oh. Poker room. He doesn't react to me at all. What are these guys doing? <coughs> ah. Let's buy some slop. Sweet. The bartender for darts. I'm the nosy type, eh? He's on a slop here. I need something to go pick up some more slop here. I don't know, things like the ship here. Okay. Military camp. Because it's used to make gunpowder, yeah. <laughs> Set up the nearest for this for cowardice. For cowardice. Nice. They keep it in little green jars. Alright. Oh, we're we'll back. No, I'm still looking. Okay. Hit it! Alright, fine. <laughs> Let's go get the darts. Okay, I get some darts. All the darts got broken a month ago. Well, guys, looks like we still don't have a dart stream. Ol Ellsbury. Tragic fella, yes. He was a writer and a poet. Came out to West to sell stories, but nobody were buying. Too weird stories. Fantastical, like. Too bad. I love that stuff. He had to get normal work to make ends meet. Did passing well as a prospector. It's the one that he lost his mind in a mind. He what now? Saw something, something that made him stop telling his weird tales, made him stop talking, near completely come to that. He just stands there by the piano nowadays, it seems to calm him down, and as long as he doesn't make any trouble, I don't mind him too much. Feel a little sort of him, to be honest. Poor fella. Need any help? What's going on with our piano player? It's supposed, to, it's not supposed to sound like that. Okay, let's see what I can. This, is, this has taken a strange turn. Open hatching cat machinery inside. There's obviously something wrong. Getting all the plinking and sproing, sproinging, and taking noise to come out of the gears and stuff. It looks pretty complicated. Ah, I see what's wrong. Nothing to it. Sounds great, doesn't it? No sun. Hello, sun cat. Fixed piano player for you. No worries, Lloyd. 
Any help? Alright. Sweet. Okay, let's, uh... Actually... Ooh, the map is... Oh, Jesus! Well... Well... Looks like we've got a bit of a game ahead of us. Oh, what can we buy here? Modern snake oiler. Plum pudding. A shovel, we already have a shovel. Soda crackers. Tooth powder. Vienna blood sausages. Okay. Well, we'll see what we can do for that at some point. Post more office. I'm been having a different. Mm, nope. Likes the postcard. Zero meat. Sweet. Flowers, why not? Okay, let's go to the desert house. Let's get an approach to in that jittery, stop motiony way that Scouts do. Judging by his hat, it appears to be the skeleton of a bean slinger. Remember the classic saying, all bean slingers die like normal people, but sometimes they keep walking around and casting spells at you afterward. <laughs> of course, we're gonna fight. Ooh, our melee attack is a lot of damage. Bam! Ship! Let's whip it with the snake! Bam! Ship! Skeleton bump. Sweet. Good stuff. Uh oh. Sneaky is my middle name. Yeah. Yeah, Sneaky is my middle name. Yeah, he is. Look how sneaky we are. This dog out contains an angry dog. Give the dog a bone. Heh. Sneaky is our middle name, guys. And we think is. Well, you see by his outfit, he's a cowboy. You see by his lack of flesh, he's a corpse. Thick chaps! <laughs> we don't use spells. Thick chaps! So I think, did we buy like some oil here or something? We should learn a new snake oiling skill. Uh, 
Yes, please. convinced me to spend my money on this game. I suppose I should give you some two kappa thanks is always less than three. <laughs> I'm directing a cowboy film called The Sun. It's set in the West. A cowboy walks into a German car showroom and says, Audi. Fuck's sake. Fuck's sake. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. Uh, that's it. Mouse. Thank you, Mouse. Appreciate that. Okay, where's that? Sorry. Where's that book? Read it. So I try listing all the new hottest poisons. Gives extra poison or passive skill that multiplies the amount of poison you apply to enemy when you poison. Debilitating toxins where they're now gives bad medicine like much skill that would will reduce the target's moxie. So an article with a list of tips to move from the grid. Gives quick on the draw, skill that increases your speed. Expert poisoning, surely. We're gonna be an expert poisoner. Hell yeah. Rats! So how do we get like some kind of oil or something? We need something to grease. something greasy. Okay. Okay, let him hear it. That's whipping. Sharp. like the way to do it. No! For a bag of ears and such. Um, so instead of arresting them, we killed them. Well, I'm not forgetting. 
Start by hiking over in Cavern Canyon. Of course. Some braided fuses sticking out of the river and let's get in person. Throw the hole in the rope and insert a bunch of dynamite by preparing this internet motor route with sending it off. Take a dynamite. Okay. Danger, a spider. That's why we're going into this one. <gasps> hey, guys. Oh, fight him. It's Phineas McGee. <laughs> No, this house looks terrible. So how do I change the oh. title? Okay, we can just start getting like that. Okay, yeah. Bam! Shoot! Roots. Take his tattooed tooth. up because it's dank cave for weeks. Cooking for the stripy hat it is. Hat it is. It sounds off. There's a perfectly good oven eight feet to my right and a shelf of perfectly good oven eight feet to my left. This is four feet long. Revolutionary, I'm not quite sure where it fits in the whole hand food taxonomy. Anyway, in the middle of it, there's a sausage. It's a sausage made from the cheapest possible parts of a pig. Grind them so finely that you can't identify them anymore. Okay. It's served from a long split roll, which looks like a grease so you can tell how fat the sausage is. The name, I'm, I'm ready. There's no point hanging around this every cave making hot dogs just for myself. Oh fuck. Oh Jesus. That's pretty cool. That is pretty cool. That's pretty good. A jaw harp. All of my empty. Okay.
weapons. A fancy knife. Is there a spitter? Medicine. Let's in four four towers again. Oh, let's keep going. Okay. Okay. Hope he's better than that. When you like this, you can just make a cannonade. There's an old mission not far from here. They might let you check out their catacombs if you ask nice. Okay. See if we can get some gunpowder here. Or some, what is it? Sulfur? Sulfur that we use? This must be the math tent. Very great whiskey. Damn it, we can't save crack yet. Dental dag daguerreotypes? Levitation at the buildings haven't been discovered yet. That kind of thing. Here we go with his marching orders. Goblins. Okay, let's leave them for now. That such as toilet in Goblin, which makes it seem pretty likely. The goblins use sense to no way you're gonna go in there. A goblin cannonball. Gormit smash, exactly. Left. More bits are great with me and a heart attack. That's right. As for boring personal efforts. I want details. Rowena Hubbard. Ninth career division, pay grade 02. Six time from the reaction satisfied. No, another C5. Pay grade. 12 missed days, accrued six days, 63. Okay. Walter Reed, C2. 25 missed days. Okay. Rebecca LeBlanc. Practice Restoration Pay Grade 04. Good conduct metal. Okay. Well, there's just there's nothing in there. <laughs> Fair enough. In general, this is a door. More specifically, it's the door to the general's office. Even more specifically, it's the locked door to the general's office. We ah, we don't have needles! Well, we've got some salt here. Uh, why are needles so hard to come by? Oh, is that the same place? Yeah, let's kill those gobos. That was 22. Okay, let's poison the 22 one. Whip it! Because you know when you were bashing, you work with how you split nations, well, it's more efficient because Rob splits more of the nations than you work with. Probably. Probably would do something like that. For sure. Come on. Oh shit. 
doctor said. Oh god, these guys. Oh no. Oh no. No! What did I do? Oh. Seven. Oh, this got is better. We'll get him this time. We'll get him this time. <coughs> okay. We're gonna get him this time. I don't know, okay, for a very deep and rectangular pothole. Oh. Not bad. Get my new knives. Get new knives. All oh, right, five to six, seven to nine. Oh shit! Uh, more knives. Can I put that there? No. Where's the fancy knife? Put it there. See you guys, Okay, this time we're gonna get him. Go and bonk us, Blade. Okay, we're gonna have to... Okay, which one? You can two-shot that guy. Okay. Oh man! The dog can't really take a hit, can she? Fuck! These girls are smart! This is bad. Throw it! Items as you want before using a skill is pretty crazy. I'll say that one. Like. They were guarding their beds. While we're heading into the tents, we're gonna steal all their loot. A field trauma kit, a chemical bullet, a full canteen. Fuck! We need more needles. Where do we get our needles? Where do we get needles, guys? She's fine, guys. Oh, nice. We 
just do come from haystacks. We need to find some haystacks. Where's that more issue? Here we go. Good medicine. Scout. Okay. Yeah, go ahead. It's a kind of hot pepper, it's called murder pepper. Because it literally has a knife and kills people who ask dumb questions. They grow out in the area at the time, you should be able to find one if you just wander around a while. Okay. Okay. Fine. Oh, guy. No, she sort of broke all of a sudden. I guess I don't get enough vitamins or whatever. Good nutrition can be difficult in this day and age. I'm going to need some medicine for this. Can you help me? Sure. There's a mission on North. The nuns are rather like a hospital. It's some medical supplies. Can you get me some broken leg pills? Broken leg pills? Wow. That's the thing. I don't have any with me. Sorry. <laughs> okay. Sure. Does this guy sell needles? Damn it. Hello. Hello. So don't have to subscribe, but Swiss Prime, thank you so much. Really appreciate it. Welcome to the family. Alright, fine. Have we got any, any meal yet? Oh! Package from Rufus. Rufus, you son of a bitch, which just had me. Motor snake oiler! You should be missing kiss. You miss your parents. You got to start just thinking about it. Nostalgia mode unlocks and options. It's a free sample of a cologne that says it will make your spleen bigger. <laughs> it's a big spleen. Apparently, you consume more potions in a day. There's Larry, the editor from in Wyoming, who had an amazing idea. What if you shot somebody three times and just once? Just found the hammer. A common skill lets you quickly do three rage attacks. <laughs> Hell yeah! That's not the same with Coast Guard. Oh, this. Thank you for it. Good job. Thanks. Give her a touch of tooth. Hell yeah. Oh shit, there's more posters. The Potem King Gang. For all nice civil engineering and flaunting of construction regulations. Okay. Yeah, sure. Check it out. Black hat bandits. Counterfeit glue. Let's go with this game. Oh, hot dog! Hey, Doug. I don't want to know what you wish you didn't know. Anyway, single air removes my business. Well, we'll buy hot dogs later. What's up, Doctor Who? All these new places, right? Stern's Ranch. How do you move there? Do you find a band of micro? A single section of micro track about to open the stars and open the team. This is a work to do. I stick it up. Most people have played up rocks, not even very interesting in the ones. However, if you let without searching the third, you end up just driving yourself crazy. I'm gonna find me now. Get sweet. I'm lucky. 
Love watching the videos for past few years now, but watching all series to catch up, you never feel to make a laugh now. I only hope you will see to the video and videos in the Your live streams are very nice and love watching the people in Thank you so much, Sundar. Appreciate that so much. Yay! Hey, hey, hey. It's past midnight. Mm. Hey, Stacks! A lot of items. Damn it, we don't have foraging. Oh. Fighting. Oh no! Why do I only have two? What? Oh shit. Shark locket. See, I'm, I don't know what I can sell, what I can get away with selling, and what I can't get away with selling. Black and beans. Mary Stearns' diary. Damn it, I'm fighting Scotty. Read it. I am diary dairy from South and I ate it. I used to have just a quick kiss up your flip ahead and say, now it's the writing game shake here. For the dolly on her cactus out back, and she told me her name was Grace. Mama and Papa don't believe me that she talks, but say I got a big imagination. Grace says the cows are gonna get us, but Papa says we'll all be okay because this were never a cow ranch. Grace says he's wrong, but Papa won't believe me. Grace says she can keep the cows away, but I have to play tea party with her. I don't like this kind of tea party, but Grace says it's important to keep the cows away. Mum was sad they couldn't find, eh, find Effie. Papa said she's been gone so long and they should put a cross up, but Mama won't let because she thinks he'll come back. Papa said she, she's only 11, how far could she have gone? And Mama started crying again. Don't want to play tea party anymore, but Grace says I has to. <laughs> Papa was out today, looking for Joey, but of course he didn't find him. Mama cries so much. I told her, I tried to tell him. I tell her him and Effie are helping keep the cows away, but she don't understand. I told Grace I'm not playing tea party again, but she says I go, and if I don't, cows will eat all three of us. She said either I get Mama or Papa to play out, or I else gotta, or else I go play by myself. Oh God. Oh Jesus. Oh. Stock certificate. Just say, oh, okay. So the things that says just sell it. Just sell. Okay, 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 okay. Okay. Oh! Damn it, we're not safe cracking yet. Oh! Bang. Uh, Wee. <laughs> the Dave Yard. Not bad. Oh, there's gonna be a lot of fighting here. Put him down for good. Shoot. The boat needs to do more damage. The boat does very little. Okay. Horn swabbing, level 2. Sc 
gold chips. Mind control powers. Okay. But we're gonna have to sell some shit. At some point. Okay, what's in this? Open a whole bunch. Okay. Hit them all. No! Might have been a bad idea. Oh god. Oh Jesus. Kill that mind control dude next. Keep healing. Keep healing, dog. Ah. Ah. No. Let's get rid of him for now. Not in my crib. Makes sense. Got him. Got him. We're out of every session. Epiphany of some sort. Alice has become stronger. Oh shit. Fuck. Okay. Let's do it again. Skeleton of Tough Dave Bowie. Ooh, did you f she just fight? Hey, Jeremy Kermit. Or Jerry Kennedy. Alright, that's cool. We should be. We can't do this. We don't have 3 AP. Very fun. Sweet. So you can basically just farm. Yeah, you can basically just farm experience there. That's not bad. Oh, jeez. Huh. Rogue receipt. Necromancer journal.
Find a receipt for delivery ropes. Look in the ropes. Surcharge for delivery. Pass border pass. Mrs. Necromancer there is definitely west of the mountain. It's good to know. Progress! So they seem to just cremains, but you will not approve. I won't. Scar them. Rest in peace, Ashes. Read the scroll. Just take a pile of human ashes, spread them out in the shape of a person inside. I don't think we can do that anyway. I don't think we wish they able to do that. Before the ritual. Human ashes start us in the glass sphere. Oops. How about we go sell some of the stuff that we don't need? The murder pepper. Shit. Not bad. Office. Back to the chef. Oh, right, we're going to sell some shit. Uh, I can sell that one. I thought we had some shit that was just... Just sell it, there we go. I'm just gonna sell the stuff that says just sell him. Honestly. Okay. Okay, that's very good. Here you go. One more favor for me. We sent this for a very secret jerk sauce. From my, friend, my jerk friend Dave J. Stole it from me. And then I died and took the secret to his grave. Literally. I mean, he was buried with it. He said he won't mind. Where's his grave then? Oh, is it at the Dave yard? Alright. We're gonna fuck. Oh, we're gonna scam some food of it. Score. Dave B. Now we need Dave J. Dave C. Dave J. 
A garbage bag. Pudding. Pudding and motor oil. Dave's secret sorcerer. Mm. Lovely. Yeah, let's walk backwards. That seems like great. Okay. <laughs> okay. Dirt war. Let's go. What do we get? A gold skull. My god. Floppy top hat. How does this look? Oh yes. Oh yes. Looks so cool. Did I start again today? Yeah, I did. I did start today. This, this is called, uh, I forgot, West of Loathing, West of Loathing, it's pretty fun, I'm enjoying it a lot, it's very, very cheesy. Let's go to... How much time do we have left? 20 minutes, okay. Let's go to the railroad camp. Just take a hand over the meat. You don't need to have a gun. An anti-punching ring. Well... Let's con, uh, let's con her out some meat. Look, see these flexes quartz as the crystal related holds the anti kick magic. I bought it from a goblin sage for 25 meat. Since you're a member of the scientific community, I'll be up to sell it for only 30. <laughs> Fuck's sake, man. <laughs> Manifest destiny. Nice work, but you get it. Burn from this guy that runs the store down south of the Button, Button Willow, Button Willow make, make something. You can't miss it, it's right in between a cactus and a different cactus. That's your. Don't mention it. Don't mention it. Which shows this outfit if I'm being charged by that fell over there in a white hat to form it. A paper back to you over there in the absurd white hats to pay for it. Right, thanks. You want to know something? I love trains. Oh! After this was a little boy, huge, magnificent, roaring iron beast. They were magical to me, like dragons. When opportunity arose to take on my management of this rail line, I jumped on it like a shot. And you know what I learned? What's that? What did he learn? <laughs> Organizing and building and running one of these operations is the most amazing pain in the ass you'll ever imagine. You want to help? Congratulations, you're the new foreman. I'm going to home to play with my models. Swell. <laughs> Oops. I'm now the foreman. Situation. Well, I'm sure you didn't miss seeing this giant pile of rocks blocking our path. So face it, there isn't any other suitable mountain pass we can't be route around. Hit even if we have the monster to take. 
Any other use for my calculation, we could dynamite it clear without too much trouble. Problem is, it will take a lot of dynamite, a whole year's worth of fear. We used to keep that much on hand for emergencies such as this one. But pack of cobbles still at all sneaky little varmints. Alright, get it back to you. Cobbles are holed up in, over in Gustafsson Gulch. It's a real tough, a rough place. You might want to spend some time getting the lay of the land and honing your fighting skills before you head that way. Especially if you plan to go and plant guns blazing. Okay. Cool. Huh. Fine. Okay, we can't really do that ghost some ghost yet, can we? The old mission, let's go there. Must be finishing in 15 minutes. Talk to it. Good, yes, good, hello. Why are you chopping a cactus down? Why? Well, a lot of uses. To building, to burning, to eating, little toothpicks. So none. What's wrong, sister? They came back. She came back. She said that they come back and took him. Our holy relics are stained. She stormed out of the catacombs and took him back. Whoa! Thought maybe they fired me if I tried to stop. The coroner will be here any minute. What am I going to do? Take a deep breath. Time to calm down. Okay, what's your name? Sister Mary. Okay, my name's Ben. What's this about saints? Our missions are mission is to protect three sacred relics. I'm the relic keeper. Is okay. What happened? The saints are so horrible. They came, they just came to life somehow. They came up out of the catacombs, all skeletal and ghastly looking. I mean, it's probably blasphemy to say that, but I nearly fainted. Yes, and if they're recovered before the Carlo gets here, I'll be in so much trouble. He's months overdue. It's not that urgent. Okay. We're going to have to fight to get the bricks back. Super blasphemy, so he's out. Okay. Okay, let's fight. Let's fight them. Thanks. Here we go. Empty. Fight! Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh fuck. Okay. I surrender. That's, uh, that was not good. That's not good. That's not good. That was not good. I'll do that some other point. Uh, Fort All Dead. Oh, shit. Okay. Yeah, I am a pussy. I was gonna die there. Okay. That's room one. Jacques. Oh. Fuck. Do I just need to get really lucky? Uh, 
Oh. Or something wiggle. <laughs> Got him. Okay. After number three. Liners. I think it's that one. Shape is different. Yeah. Okay. 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 Nice. Damn it, we don't have safe cracking. God damn it. How do we. Uh, okay, let's not do like a spell XP and see if we can get some safe cracking. No, we, we can't even. Ugh. Damn it. Deal with them. Turn him in. <laughs> A thousand meat. Got him. The Gherkin Brothers. I think we've got time for one more mission and then we're done. So let's go to the Bannon Pickle Factory. See if we can actually do that already. Fight it! <laughs> Holy! Done it. Fuck is this game? This is a great game. That's why it is. Get suited up. Hey, the kid, you better stop taking this up for granted. You think you're gonna find a place with a nice dormitory in a reasonably priced company store like ours somewhere else? With your skills? Ha! <laughs> you're doing three shifts today, Buster. Get to work, your pickle hopper duty. Okay, let's start the shift. Pick hoppers when you ragged, like always, keeping the hoppers failed to keep a constant flow down their shoots, which are constantly at a near sprint. Because you have to manage the shoot stunts to keep the levels equal. If you've got evil pickles, if you got evil pickle levels, from Mr. Flash knows. Nobody knows how she knows what she knows. If whacking with cane is the minimum you'll get. Can we still see sandwich with the mouth for Mrs. Flask? Glares at her pocket watch, counting down three minutes into the second. Second shift. Managing the salt tank is in strangers as the pickle hoppers, but it's still a never ending tension to prime situation as the cousin. Fuck. Okay. What the fuck? 
fortune and shoveling corn to a furniture, furnish up against giant tank of oil, vinegar, it's things in here. You try to do it with your ass closed, it's as fast as if you drop it. Cool the floor, if the temperature gets a lot too high, you'll just... Oh my god! 198 degrees, no, 189, no, 189, so we pay you for it. Never waste your sense of smell or cooking all the time. Oh god. Let me out. Enter. Pull it. sleep. Uh. Alright, we'll figure this I guess we'll figure this out next week. We only have five minutes left. Quickly get the lads growing, at the very least. <laughs> See what I can do. Get those two equal. Is this right? Put him out of his misery. Oh God. Oh Jesus. No, it's getting blocked by a cucumber. What does it need to be again? <laughs> 190, yeah? So there's a 3 per hole? <laughs> 36. Six hundred sixty one. Five, five, okay. Another five. No, one hundred eighty nine, right? One hundred ninety eight. A 
let's try let's try this for that. I'm just like this. Oh. I have, I have run the ads from the stream ads. Don't worry about it. Let's go for it. I've done it. But yeah, that is the end of the stream. <laughs> that is the end of the stream. We'll figure this puzzle out next time. Actually, we should talk to this guy. Huh. Cool. Alright, thank you guys so much for watching. This was fun. We'll play this again next week. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um... Catch me tomorrow again with Ravs. Uh, we're gonna do, we're gonna try to do something special for his birthday. Um, so yeah, I hope to see you there. Enjoy Zoe's stream for now, and uh, yeah, have a very good evening. And if you're watching the Dota Ti, have fun with that, and good luck. Bye bye bye.